Welcome back. This morning we're starting to see some of the damage left behind by Hurricane Hannah. That's the hurricane that hit the Gulf Coast of Texas over the weekend. So take a look at this video. This is a hospital in southern Texas. You can see the floodwaters just spread throughout all of the hallways there. Staff was trying to move those patients up to a higher floor to get them out of that flood water. Parts of Texas saw up to 14 inches of rain and look at what the wind did. The wind was so strong it actually knocked over a big rig. You saw that a couple seconds ago. At least four people are now dead and six others are missing and tens of thousands are still without power this morning. This is the first major hurricane of the season and I want to bring in meteorologist Justin Bruce right now because Justin we know another storm with hurricane potential is not far uh, behind this one and it has a long complicated name but it's going to uh, likely form into a tropical storm with a uh, slightly less complicated name. Yeah, we think that this is uh, going to turn into the I storm, the letter I, and that is this year in the Atlantic, Isaias, an interesting pronunciation. Uh, but right now it is just an area of concern. Uh, the meteorological name, Tropical Wave Invest 92-L, this now has 40 mile per hour sustained winds. This is well east of the Lesser Antilles, could become, uh, you know, if it gets to tropical storm strength, which is a very likely to do in the next couple of days it would be tropical storm Isaias and then it would perhaps drift across the lesser Antilles the greater Antilles including Puerto Rico maybe uh, Haiti the Dominican Republic and the possible track uh, could eventually bring it toward the southeast US so we'll hear a lot about that as we head through the next week